Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Wilmar. Today I want to talk about something that's been on my mind, which is VV's marketing strategy. For a long time, I've always been curious on when marketing. Uh, this seems to be a very logical thing to do, considering A, how much we've been growing, our licenses, our amazing collectibles, and all the revenue we get from these drops. Last but not least, we have partnered with one of the largest marketing agencies out there. Uh, they represent people like Jimmy Fox, Justin Bieber, David Beckham, Elton John, Sandra Bullock, so many others. And they have done huge marketing, marketing campaigns for brands like Heineken, Mastercard, and YouTube. Somebody asked this when marketing question in the most recent AMA with Coastline Media. And Jeremy, before stepping out, mentioned how advertising can actually negatively impact an organization that's growing at a pace that's so rapid. Uh, and essentially, I will tell you all the time in toys, we will pull advertising if we're if we're advertising to empty shelves. I thought that was a very interesting statement, so I kept on listening. And I also went back to the past AMAs with Dan and David to understand why they haven't done it. And um, this is what I have learned. It's very mind opening. So there are two reasons why VV has not done any paid advertising. Reason number one, technically we are not ready yet. And this is more on the technical side. In the AMA after the Edo drop, David mentioned that they had about 50,000 people lined up for about 2,000 minutes of Edo, that which sold out in maybe half, less than half a second. That means that one out of 50 people and our bot, which I'm not gonna talk about today, was able to get Edo. The ratio of one out of 50 or 2% is fine for me. It is what it is. What concerned me was that our system was not able to handle that much traffic. After clicking on buy now, I got kicked out and I only saw a hopeless gray blank screen and I couldn't even get the drop. I haven't been able to get any ultra rare or secret rare for a long time. I know many other people in the edit drop couldn't even get the page to load and that was just kind of terrible. So, you know, with the capacity that we have, do you think we'll be able to handle hundreds of thousands of fans from the Pokemon, from Disney, from Star Wars communities? Probably not. But if we were to do a marketing push to onboard hundreds of thousands of people, uh, I bet you these things will happen. A, lots of people will not be able to get drops. B, they will have a terrible user experience simply because the system could not handle that much traffic. People will experience lagginess. They will see the, the de desperate, hopeless blank screens. Um, people will get frustrated and they will feel unfair and they will leave the app forever. So it's not that VV doesn't have any marketing strategy, it's that they haven't done it yet because the system and the capacities are not ready. In my personal experience, I joined VV in late February and my first drop was Nightwing, which turned out to be a nightmare because the app was so laggy. Luckily, I was able to cop Nightwing, but I didn't have a great experience. I was about to leave, but then two weeks later, they came out with the DeLorean, so I came back but the drops after that were just terrible. So I basically left VV and focused more on the OMI token. I later came back maybe uh, a month and a half later when things started to improve. You may ask why they haven't increased the bandwidth and the capacity to handle a large amount of users. When I came back to the app, um, I asked myself this question too, but I noticed that the experience was a lot better. Pages load faster. And so I knew that they have been working on it, which is a great thing. Uh, I think the other reason is that we expect so much, but in technology even, things don't move that fast like our expectation. For a small team like Ecomi and Vivi, um, they have so many exciting projects. They have this capacity thing, they have the migration to Immutable X, they have the money transfer license, um, they have the Viviverse, and now they have maybe three, sometimes four drops a week. So many exciting things going on, so I think it's best for us to be patient. Reason number two, I think we've been doing really well with our organic growth. From my observations, the commitment and the contribution from our amazing VV community and the help from sponsors like how Marvel always tweet about every single Marvel drops on VV have done us wonderful. Initially, I think the team would only hope that the users or us would just simply share photos with our collectibles and hopefully things would go viral. But our community has got so created and committed that now you see these multi-day Twitter spaces, um, all these vault design competitions, which is amazing. Having the endorsement from our IPs is a great way to grow our brand organically as well. You've seen these tweets from Marvel. Every single tweet that Marvel 
put, put out um, is worth more than any paid advertising because these are organic real Marvel fans that will be coming to VV. To me, what Jeremy said is a great business lesson. Um, and in this case, patience is really patience. This is not financial advice, but I wouldn't think of this lack of paid advertising as a problem. Instead, I think it's an opportunity for many of us to buy the collectibles we want before the mass audience come in and price go up. Uh, this is a, a great chance for us to complete our set and stack up on Omi. Again, not financial advice, but if you look at the data, the prices have trended upward since the beginning. So over time, things always go up. And especially when they actually do pet advertising, I, I strongly believe that all the prices of the collectibles and Omi will rocket. Let's see you guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you have enjoyed the video, please give a like and subscribe to my channel. Also, please let me know what you think in the comment section below. And uh, thank you so much and I'll see you next time.